guys welcome back to my channel welcome back to a fun little vlog video i am at home bargains we have a pretty big home bargains near us and i'm not gonna lie it's just after 8 a.m on a monday morning i'm here for opening time so hoping it's quiet car park seems fairly quiet so fingers crossed we're going to be quite inside. So I thought I'd bring you guys along with me this morning. I needed to pick up a couple of little bits. But I know they've got all their Christmas stock. So I know it's not quite November yet. But we're getting festive. And I feel like I'm going to go full on after Halloween. In terms of Christmas shop. I'm Christmas shopping now. But I'm not showing you guys or sharing too much Christmas content. Other than just vlogging in store. So either way i'm very excited if you haven't already please do stick around and subscribe i have another video very similar coming up probably next week i'm going to do a come to b&m and poundland type video so stay tuned for that by subscribing and hitting that notification bell so you can be notified as soon as that video is uploaded and then i'll also leave my instagram accounts left down below if you did want to follow me over on there i have two i have my fashion one and i have my homeware one make sure you have your nice cozy drinks and snacks ready to relax come shopping with me and let's go look at all the leaves feeling very autumnal right let's get a trolley oh these look nice i've never seen these before i feel like they make a nice little stocking filler anyway i'm on the hunt for some christmasy festive cleaning products as well because i think i might do another seasonal speed clean and they've got the seasonal reed diffusers as well. I think I like the vanilla sugar cookies, but the gingerbread one is my fave. And they're only $1.99. So yeah, I did the autumn speed clean, which you guys seem to like. So I kind of want to do a Christmassy one too. They have loads of fun little gift ideas for Christmas. I'm always intrigued to see what their perfume would be like, the $3.99 one. Um, looks very Jo Malone-esque, but yes, if gin and tonic and Prosecco is for you, then they have some cute little gift ideas, and they also have some festive calendars, $5.99 for this one, 12 days of pampering, black orchid, amber, warm vanilla sugar, yum, I also love the look of these. I think I might be tempted to get one of these. They're $2.99 for the set. This one's orange, clove, and cinnamon. And then they also have festive fig and pomegranate. They have that one too, but I think these ones look nice. They're the Winter Wonderland sets. These look nice too. They have mulled wine, candy cane, hot chocolate and vanilla, and gingerbread cookie. They have lots of the seasonal bits in, and still loads of the Halloween bits, but 79p for a little happy Halloween sign like that. I think it's so cheap. You could definitely put that like on your front door maybe. And they have a trick and treat one as well. These are so yummy. Tom got jealous that I had the white versions the other day, but 99p they have the Reese's Pieces ones and then just plain pumpkin patch cakes, loads of treats, all the decoration, the trick and treat bowls. And then the outfits as well. I actually really like this wreath. It's $1.99, which is so affordable. And I'm tempted to just get it and put it on our front door. We don't have a wreath on our front door this year. They actually have a front door mat as well, $4.99, if you're interested. And then I've spotted these in the past, but I've actually only seen the Halloween versions, not the black pumpkin ones. And for 99p, you could just put them like in a glass vase maybe buy a few and it'd be like a kind of flower display but little pumpkins I think that's quite cute if you have any nights out coming up like Halloween dressing up this weekend they have some cute little face stickers and gems or if you've got a pamper night 79p they have glow masks in these Halloween editions I thought this was a vase at first but is it a jug yeah it's a jug oh that would be cute if you're having like a Halloween house party oh I spy Christmas how exciting does this make you that is gorgeous this is kind of my theme as well with the browns, golds and like animal woodland type theme. $1.99, little mini peacock wreath. I feel like if blues and greens were your theme, that would be beautiful. Okay, this is very exciting to me. In fact, before we go down that aisle, let's just have a look at these. 79p. 
Look, there's only one white one left. I think I might get that. I'm just thinking white company. Anything that I feel would look nice in the white company, I'm going for it. I have never seen a wreath like this before. It's beautiful. It's just plain gold and kind of like cream colored. 499 says it's iridescent glitter wreath. That's how they describe it. That is so pretty. And then they have the wreath hangers as well if you need one of those. They've got the natural wreaths. You know, I'd be tempted to get one of these, but I'm actually booked onto a wreath making class, which I'm so excited for in December. So um, I'm gonna hold off making my own one until then. These are good gift bags. I feel like they're very expensive looking. I feel like something like that with a Joe Malone candle in would be really nice and they're only 89p. Oh, I might get one of these actually. Yeah, I think I'm gonna stock up on a couple of these because you just, you can never be too early. They even have these giant wreaths in at 7 99 all plain, which I actually quite like the plain look. But if you did want to like DIY it and add some bits on, you could easily do so at 7 99 that is so full. I feel like I might come back for one of those. Oh my god, these are the biggest baubles I have ever seen. You can even see my reflection in them. They're bigger than my hand. That is how big they are. They are huge. Well, these are pretty. A bit of glitz, $1.99. And then they have these tiny ones. Look at the size difference. I've got some more giant baubles down there in red and green. And then all of these decorations as well. There is just so many. I feel like I could do a more in-depth Christmassy vlog in November around Home Bargain. So let me know if that's something that you'd be interested in watching. This is just so much. I want to get around the whole store, not just the Christmas bits today. Christmas crackers, wrapping paper. They literally have it all already. This little, oh, I say little reindeer, he's actually pretty big. He'd be good in a garden, 19.99. And then they have loads of different gift sacks, but I love that they have initial ones. So you could get like personalized ones this year, 2.99. I quite like these ones as if it's male. Oh God, do you see what I mean? I love them. Then they have all the like electrics area where there's loads of light up bits and things that you can maybe have outdoors. Little more for, in my opinion, if you've got a bigger house. But like those little glitter reindeer set would be cute. They're actually just for indoors though. Um, you see, I wouldn't have the space for two big reindeers like that. Maybe the presents though, they're quite nice. Oh, I feel like this section was made for me. All the whites and the golds, so pretty. And again, they have these extra large baubles in loads of different colors as well. Oh my God, these ones. These would be beautiful clipped onto the tree. They might all sell out pretty quick. Although I don't know how much these are. Um, they've got these that you could stick into the tree as well, which could be really nice. I kind of wish there was more of those clips, but I can't see any. How pretty are these? $1.99. I feel like if the little top part was gold, I'd go for these, but the fact that they're silver kind of puts me off. But how pretty are these with the white feathers in? I don't even know if it's focusing on it properly, but oh my god, they are beautiful. How pretty is this little stag? He is six. 99 and I think they do these in silver and gold as well but I quite like the white one that's that size but I've just actually spotted even bigger ones at 7.99 like look at the size difference they're huge I feel like a gold and a white one next to each other could look quite nice in front of the tree what do you guys think or if you're not a fan of the glittery ones they have those kind of brushed metallic ones as well in gold and then there are some in silver down there as well look at me just waving this thing around i really like it i think i'm gonna get it i've just spotted these little initial ones and obviously the first one is air which is so adorable silver isn't really my theme but 39p so good for that and you could get one for every family member this little wreath thing is quite cute it says it's a candle base so you can put a little candle in there, make it look all festive. Oh, there's this cute little pink and rose gold section if that's your theme. I mean, it's not the biggest, but they have a few bits to choose from. And I've just discovered that there's a whole other Christmas aisle, which I didn't know about. So this is more for 
kitchenware, PJ's throws, bedding. That's quite a pretty throw with the little gold snowflakes, $5.99. I quite like this fair owl print though. Oh, these are adorable, 99p if you have your first baby, baby's first Christmas, you put a little photo in there. If you're hosting, we're not, so I never have to shop kitchenware or anything. Um, but these would be quite a nice cheese board. It's a serving board in the shape of Christmas tree. If you're baking cakes for people this year, you could package them up in these cute little cupcake boxes. They even have loads of festive table runners. I mean, this one is very festive. I actually really like that, it's so soft. Uh, they have cotton aprons, gloves, literally you could go all out and do your entire kitchen Christmassy themed. And even if red isn't your theme, they also have nice neutral colors as well. They seem to have loads of gin and Prosecco themed um, items which could make good, good little gifts. I feel like that could be a cute little serving platter for snacks and nibbles or put little cookies on there. They have some really nice festive candles. These ones are in like a star shape in gold or silver. They've got the little pine cones, the Christmas trees, the reed diffusers. Um, I actually really like these because they're quite neutral. Neroli Lime and Basil, which is very Joe Malone scented inspired. It's triple wick. And yeah, I feel like with the whole winter woodland theme, again, quite uh, white company, $7.99 for that huge candle. And they have some dried orange slices and dried moss, which you could do like a festive wreath with. And then they have all their signature Christmassy scents. The gingerbread one is so nice. I've not tried that one actually. I'm gonna have a sniff of that one. But this advent calendar would be great. Oh, they have two different designs, $3.99 and $4.99. What's the difference here? There's four cents in there, and there's four cents in there. That's weird. This must just be this year's, and maybe these are left over from last year, because that is, oh no, that's Airwick, so it's just placed wrong. Yeah, so all of these are 3 dollars Yet again, another Christmas aisle. There's so much stuff. I really like these if you want to do like a DIY um, advent calendar, and you put little gifts that you kind of make yourself in, $14.99, that's really affordable. And then they have these cheaper felt ones for $4.99. I love matchmakers. And they now do gingerbread, which sounds amazing. So cheap, $7.99, 7.99p. I feel like these snow blankets could look good as a tree skirt if you wanted to put them like at the bottom of the tree and make it look like it's snowed and then you've got these little snowflakes that you can sprinkle over your tree if you like that kind of snow dusted tree look I spy Mrs. Hinch. I've spotted these in the past and oh it's 6 99 I was gonna say they've reduced to 1 99 they haven't that's them but this is quite good for 6 99 it's quite a big milk churn and um, you could put outside inside different flowers in I am actually after a vase but I just want a plain glass one. I feel like this is quite new I don't remember seeing thick chunky scarves, hats, earmuffs, gloves all of these last year but I think they're really nice. Good for bonfire night maybe because I have no doubt it will probably be quite cold which I'm not mad about because I kind of like to be all cozy on bonfire night and watch the fireworks and everything so. They have so many things from the lunar range which has all the different um, star signs on it. Fun fact my mum's an Aquarius. I am Capricorn and I tend to be most compatible with Taurus. I'm quite, I've quite a lot of good friends that are Tauruses, so yeah, fun fact there. And then they have loads more of the initial range. I've seen this range from Jeff Banks before, the throws that they do in this kind of um, muted blue, this beige taupe kind of color and white. And they're actually on clearance at the minute for $19.99. I've bought these in the past because mainly because I love the branding. Two ninety nine they are, and I do like them. I like the look of them more than anything. I don't think they're that strong, but I guess for two ninety nine, I even question that question the high end rediffusers. To be completely honest with you, I feel like 
if it's in a big room, it smells nice initially, but even when you keep changing the reeds, they're not that strong. I think candles make a big difference and incense. But reed diffusers, I don't know. Does anyone else feel that way? I like the look of them though, so I do like having them. I do question how good they actually are though. These look so nice, pure wax melts in home baking. Yum, salted caramel, <gasps> apple cinnamon. So I'm not gonna lie, I do still prefer Zaflora, but in the Fabulosa they have apple spice and spiced pumpkin um, for the Halloween range, and I'm currently using the spiced pumpkin one. It does smell really nice. I just don't feel like they're as strong as Zaflora. That's the only thing. Ah, I found a dupe for the VI Poo thing spray. How funny. This is only 99p. The others are like five quid so expensive especially for just like a fun little novelty novelty stocking filler i've just found that they do the fabric refresher in the febreze vanilla latte so i think i'm going to pick this one up it's one pound 49 i usually really like the lavender i have a little bit left of our lavender one though so i'm going to try this i actually have a card box at home where i just like to purchase as and when i see a nice card i'll buy it then and there and then maybe um, well then I just have like a stockpile of cards for as and when an occasion comes up how cute is that guy um, I don't see any new ones though to be honest with you so I have some of these already in my card box uh, but yeah it's just just a nice little idea if you think that you'd like to do that too see that's really pretty with some glittery bits in 69p I feel like the cards here are so cheap Look, from 29p some of them quite like these crates of storage they've got 3.99 4.99 5.99 in grey and white but I obviously obviously prefer the white ones I've actually had this set in the past 6.99 it is for this bath mat set but I had it with instead of grey it was beige but I thought I'd show you the grey and cream um, and then they've got this one like the reverse version as well they have this diary which is in the wedding section 199 it's obviously designed for losing weight for your wedding or just watching what you're eating but I just had a quick look inside and you could definitely use it if you're not getting married and if you're just wanting to uh, watch what you eat or whatever they've got loads of food diary pages um, week 9 so like overall week summaries exercise trackers um, again week summaries measurements that you do so bar that you can always cross it out and put a holiday or something also I wanted to come and see these because I like them as a sweet jar and I feel like they could be quite cute with um, white colored lints in it so it's all very cream and my style 6.99 I'm still unsure because I have seen that they do a Christmas tree version so the reason why I'd be getting it would be for the festive season so I might keep my eyes peeled for the Christmas one I have seen it in the past I should have probably picked it up um, when they had them in stock but if I see the Christmas tree one again I think I'm gonna get it I like this table it's uh, oh it's 16.99 I saw it 11.99 B&M though they have one for 10 pounds in a circular shape as opposed to hexagonal and I do think I prefer that one I also love this I keep spotting it every time I come in we don't really need it and haven't got space for it but 29.99 I love the like macrame design and then they even have these kind of matching cushions at 6.99 still have these throws in 24.99 they do them in pink, grey and white. I definitely wouldn't get cosy with this though because they have like a really weird texture. It's one of those that looks great, but no offence, feels awful. I love Horlicks at this time of the year. I feel like it's such a cosy, seasonal, autumnal kind of warming drink. But I've just spotted that they now have chocolate. I've never seen the chocolate one before. £1.79. I've tried the toffee nut ones before, but I recently picked up this because seasonal edition, caramelised honey latte. I've been keeping my eyes peeled for the gingerbread ones, but I don't think they do them anymore because I'd have thought they'd have brought them out by now. Um, but I, I do like that one. It's quite subtle. You can tell I'm coming to the end because I'm at the food section, but oh my God. How amazing do these look? I feel like these are going to be one of those things that some people will go, ooh, no, far too sweet and sickly. 
and some, like me, would look at and go, oh my god, yes. And just like that, we're back home. Excuse all the washing in the background. You did see me put in the trolley this selection of gift bags. Again, you might as well just get them nice and early. 59p for the small one, 79p for the medium, and then the two bigger ones, these shapes, were both 89p. I picked up another one of these because we broke ours, and it's actually really handy to have this like silicon, it's good for scrambled egg as well, this silicon spatula. I did pick up one of the Febreze vanilla latte scented sprays. Oh, God, a couple more bits in there I can't show you yet. And then I did get some seasonal cleaning products. I went with the Glade Spiced Apple Kiss spray. So all of these you'll see in um, probably like a seasonal cleaning video, like I said. And then we have Festive Pomegranate Fairy. I'm going with like a red and green theme um so oh my god how exciting i got the febreze in apple spice scent oh, yum i love apple scented products um so i told you about the fabulosa halloween ranges installed but they also had some christmasy scents in so i went with christmas tree in that one and then i also picked up three of the zaflora limited edition christmas I feel like they say limited edition, but these are the same as what they had last year. I think this one's slightly different packaging. I might be making that up, I'm not sure. But the cranberry and orange one is probably my favourite, followed by warm cinnamon and then winter morning, but they're all amazing. And then I got a Harpic Mountain Pine. So that is everything that I picked up that I'm going to show you for now. Stay tuned for some seasonal content coming very, very soon, literally probably days away now under two weeks is it i don't know but either way i'm so so excited for christmasy content i even have a very new intro which i'm so excited to put out there so i'll start all of that christmasy content in november if there are any specific christmasy festive content videos that you do want to see please please do pop them in the comments below i read them all so i have a little list of video ideas already and i want to add to it so please 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 do give me ideas and suggestions of some of your favorite videos to watch maybe some new ideas anything festive related leave it below and i'll be sure to add it to my list so thank you so much for watching this little come shopping with me to home bargains i hope you enjoyed it thumbs up if you did stay tuned for more videos coming very soon i love you all so so much and i hope to see you all in my next video bye guys